Welcome to Leon, the largest city in the Mexican state of Guanajuato. Leon, together with Guanajuato and Silao, will host the second edition of the Rally of Nations on the special stages of Rally Mexico WRC. The TER 2022 season kicks off in Robin Yemen with the first TER promo event of the year, Arctic Lapland Rally, followed by the first round of the TER series in Tuscany, Rally Terra Valle del Tavare. Many surprises await TER in Mexico. Hola, amigo. Please take a seat. Thank you. <laughs> the Mexico Rally organizers, ready to re-enter the World Rally Championship and awaiting their return in the highest rally series, have organized the second edition of Rally of Nations Guanajuato. The rally maintains the characteristic stages of WRC Rally Mexico with a particular format. The crews are divided into national teams made up of two cars. One of the main features is that even a team with small cars can win the rally since standings will comprise of a point system calculated with a penalty coefficient for those cars which have more power. Hence, the fight is open to all drivers. The second edition of the Rally of Nations Guanajuato is divided into three days and 229 kilometers of special stages. Hello, bienvenidos a todos. Los invitamos a que vengan y disfruten de este gran evento aquí en Silao, Guanajuato. Among the protagonists in Guanajuato, in Team Finland, the winner of 2002 Rally Mexico, Hari Rovanpera. Ford WRC Works driver Adrian Formo stars in Team France with 1994 WRC champion Didier Auriol, who is forced to leave Mexico before the start of the rally due to family problems and is replaced by Felipe Superville. I think we'll have a really good fun with all the, all the competitors and, uh, and also the, the, the atmosphere it looks to be amazing. First time for me and uh, I'm really looking forward to, to do the start. For Team Norway, Mats Osberg will try to win the Rally of Nations with Ewin Brynaldsson. Yeah, I think it will be a lot of fun. Uh, the spectators, as always, is really enthusiastic and the competition is really strong as well, so I think it will be a fun weekend. TER Ambassador Hiroki Arai will represent the Japanese team with Hiranao Ishii. It's an amazing feeling. Everywhere is have fun and actually quite looking forward to it. So exciting rally. Alberto Battistoli, leader of the 2022 TER Tour European Rally, defends Team Italy with Andrea Mabellini. It has been a great occasion to see the road where the WRC uh, has come. So uh, I'm, my plan is to enjoy and to have fun here. It is not a simple thing since the stages are really demanding, but we will do the possible. Two 2022 TER drivers from Team Europe, Romanian Sebastian Barbu and German Nicky Chalet. You see it around, the spectators like hell. And they are not only here for something, so for them we are all heroes. They enjoy, they give us a feeling that we are really higher level. It's really unbelievable here. Well, we expect a lot of uh, warm weather, <laughs> hot in the car, but uh, yeah, we also want to do a really well well job here and uh, to compete well and uh, yeah impressed on the stages why not among the mexican teams the protagonists are the winner of the 2021 nacam junior series patrice spitalier and the national idol benito guerra jr teaming up with his father i'm competing and representing team mexico one 
with my dad in the other car. So we have a big responsibility here to, to have for Mexico a great result. Uh, I feel very confident. I know the stages. I know my car. Uh, I know I could be really fast in this in this local event for me. We're looking for for the best possible result. Of course, the best Mexicans. That's a, that's a, that would be a very a very good for us. And then, of course, why not look for a podium and everything? In the battle for victory are also Matthew Wilson of Team UK, Nils Solans, Team Spain, and the representatives of Ecuador, USA, and Latin America. Guanajuato, the historical UNESCO World Heritage Site City, hosts the kickoff of the 2022 Rally of Nations with the two passes on the famous street stage in a unique atmosphere full of public and fans. <laughs> Mads Osberg and Johan Johansson are fastest with their Skoda Fabia R5 in both stages ahead of Benito Guerra Jr. in a sister car. The Ford Fiesta Rally 2 of Adrian Formo and Alexander Coria follows in third place in the overall standings of the rally. Fourth place for Matthew Wilson and Stuart Loudon ahead of the Citroen C3 R5 of Mexican Cordero and the Mitsubishi of Spanish Nils Solans. In the Rally of Nations standings, Team Mexico 4 with Francisco Nemi's Mitsubishi and Urio Stagui's Renault is the leader after the first two stages with 90 points. Second place for Team Italy, Battistoli and Mabellini, 79 points. <laughs> Team Europe is third with Nikki Shelley's Ford Fiesta and Sebastian Barbu's Renault at 72 points. Mads Osberg is fastest after the first day. Team Mexico 4 leads Rally of Nations Guanajuato. The hot temperatures and altitudes over 2,000 meters of Guanajuato State await the crews on stages which are part of the World Rally Championship's history. Mads Osberg pushes hard from the beginning of the day, is fastest on special stages 3, 4, 5, 6, and 7, and leads the standings ahead of Formo by 152. The Frenchman, Works WRC driver, is second at midday, attempting to manage his large advantage over Guerra's Fabia R5, third at 321 from the leader.
The fourth place of Brynjolfsson enables Team Norway to take second place in the Rally of Nations classification behind Team Europe with the TER drivers on top of the standings. The European team, Sebastian Barbu, co-driven by Bogdan Yanku, and Nikki Shelley with Lena Matter at his side, leads with 307 points, ahead of Norway with 303.5. Third with 249.5 points is Team Italy. After a good start for Alberto Battistoli and Simone Scatoline, the 2022 TER series leader retire from the first leg due to an issue on their Mitsubishi. But with the points gathered by Andrea Mabellini and Virginia Lenzi, they remain on the provisional podium of the Rally of Nations. Team France is fourth with Formo and Superville ahead of Ecuador with Javier Serrano and Diego Serrano. Sixth is Team Mexico 3, who leads Mexico 1, 2, and 4. UK team is 10th ahead of Spain with Nils Solans and Mark Marty retired on stage 4 due to a mechanical failure. Twelfth place for Team Japan with an unlucky Hiroki Arai also retired in the SS4 with his Subaru. USA, Latin America, and the other Mexican team complete the standings halfway through leg one. Mads Osberg is the fastest after SS7. Team Europe leads Rally of Nations Guanajuato. Second part of the day, the drivers return for the last loop on the special stages of Guanajuato and Otates before ending the day with two special stages inside the Autodromo de Leon circuit. Mads Osberg continues to dominate the rally and is fastest in all of the first leg stages. The Norwegian leads the rally by 107 on Adrian Formo's Fiesta, despite a one-minute penalty at a time control. The Frenchman doesn't seem to have the same rhythm as Osberg, but manages his lead over Guerra, third at 203 behind him. Wilson overtakes Brinson in fourth position, while sixth and seventh are the two Finns, Koronin and Rovin Para. Team Norway takes the lead in the Rally of Nations with 462 points, ahead of Team Europe. Shell Barbu, second with 409 points. <laughs> Team France is third, far from the second step of the podium with 274 points, ahead of Team Italy. Badasoli and Mabellini are fifth with Team Italy at the end of the first leg, ahead of Team Mexico three, represented by Patrice Battalier, co-driven by Nicolas Battalier, and Emilio Velasquez with Javier Marin at his side. <laughs> Team Ecuador is sixth, ahead of Mexico one, which loses Benito Guerra Sr., who retired due to a mechanical problem. Wilson and Williams, Team UK, are eighth in front of Cordero and Hernandez, Team Mexico 2. <laughs> Ro 
Rovanperä and Koronen are in 10th place with the Finland team. The winner of the 2002 Rally Mexico, after a difficult start, is growing stage by stage and sets very good times. Mads Osberg continues to dominate the rally. Team Norway leads Rally of Nations Guanajuato. Do I need to take a four spare wheel maybe? Four spare! <laughs> <laughs> maybe every each time you are like losing like because Ooh. altitude is so high. Like, ah yes. I heard like 3,000 meters yeah, on the yeah, highest really high point of the yeah. stage. So. The magic Mexican atmosphere says good morning to the last day of competition. Five special stages and we will know which team will be the winner of the 2022 Rally of Nations Guanajuato. With Osberg into the lead and Team Norway leading Rally of Nations, all seems done. But anything can happen. And it happens. Brinson abandons the rally on the first stage of the day due to a mechanical problem. Now for Team Norway, it will be difficult to hold on to the leadership. Osberg continues to win stages. He is fastest on SS12 and 13, and second on the 14th, only one-tenth behind Formo. In a safe third position, Benito Guerra manages his advantage on Wilson. Fifth and sixth to the two finish, Koronin and Rovan Perra. The surprise arrives in special stage 14, when, following the retirement of Brinson on the 12th test, Team Europe collects enough points to overtake Norway with two stages to go. The TER drivers Sebastian Barbu and Nicky Schelle have two stages and must manage their advantage on Norway, which is left with only Osberg. Team Europe leads Rally of Nations Guanajuato. Two stages to go. Mads Osberg wins the penultimate stage, but on the last one he has a puncture. Loses one and a half minutes and finishes the rally just 5.8 seconds ahead of Formo. We enjoyed the weekend a lot for sure. Uh, it was a uh so many nice stages and uh, our performance as well was, uh, was really good, so we are happy about that. But the battle is for the Rally of Nations. Which team will be the winner? 10th, final place for Team Mexico 4, Naimi Urio Stegui, just behind Mexico 2, Cordero Hernandez.
an unlucky second part of the race for Team Italy, 8th at the end. 6th place for Team Ecuador, Diego Serrano and Javier Serrano, ahead of Mexico 1, Guerra Jr. and Guerra Sr. Wilson and Williams bring Team UK in 5th position with their Ford Fiesta. With 416.5 points, Team Mexico 3 takes 4th place with Velasquez and Spitalier. The latter announced his participation in the 2022 Tour European Rally Series from the next event. Adrian Formo and Philippe Superville climb on the third step of the podium with Team France. SS15 Sebastian Barbu has a problem on his Clio and leaves the race. Despite Barbu retiring, Team Europe with the two TER Series crew, German Nikki Shelley, co-driven by Lena Metter, and Romanian Sebastian Barbu and Bogdan Yanku win the second edition of Rally of Nations Guanajuato. Son los ganadores absolutos, Nikki Shelley, Lina Meter, Sebastian Barbu y Bogdan Yanku. Bogdan, congratulations. We had a lot of uh, kilometers here, a lot of experience on asphalt, on uh, tarmac, sorry. Now we go back on asphalt. We definitely need some tests uh, for the tarmac events. But we're looking forward for a really, really good season, a full season with a lot of wins and uh, of course, race uh, as much as possible in the TER and why not win the championship? Ahí está un aplauso para los ocupantes de los tres primeros sitios absolutos del Rally de las Naciones 2022. <laughs> An unbelievable moment. So when I came over, I thought, hey, yeah, let's see what's going on. But uh, to come here, then you see the stages. You're driving on the stages and said, oh my God, I'm in heaven. I'm in really heaven here. And this gravel is unbelievable. It's wide, it's narrow, it's jumps, it's everything. And then uh, the spectators out there, they are so motivated, even here, they are coming to you. So for me, was sure you have to give everything. And I was pushing like hell. I gave everything and I'm so happy that I can be here. I'm happy that I'm invited also with the TER. They helped me that I can come here and it's an unbelievable thing. Thanks a lot for this and I'm so happy! Oh, claro que sí. Venga. Mads Osberg and John Johansson are the fastest crew in Mexico. Team Europe is the winner of the 2022 Rally of Nations Guanajuato. Ah, so oh, yeah. first time for this first time here in Mexico, and you? Oh, me, it's the second time. Oh, I really? I have not a lot of experience of, uh, <laughs> on this rally, but okay. okay. I mean, it's a gravel rally anyway. <laughs> yeah, yeah. So just driving like a smoothly, like a old man now. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> no, no, no. Clean and slow. <laughs> you know, it's what I say to Denis Giraudet always. Yeah. Because he pushed me always to make some rally uh -huh. to come here, you know. If it's if it's me now, I say no, I stop completely. <laughs> I did, yeah, you yeah. come here, come here, yeah, come. Yeah. we go to Mexico together. Okay, I come, yeah, yeah. just enjoy to be <laughs> nice. together. Okay. Viva Mexico, Gavrones.
number one. Papa. <laughs> The Tour European Rally will return from May 19th to the 23rd in France with Rally Antibes Côte d'Azur. <laughs>